What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Leaf Green walkthrough. Okay, so, after thinking it through, and uh, yeah, it was just right in front of me, because usually when I'm doing a walkthrough, I'm kind of watching a video here too, you know, just to keep me entertained, I'm that multi-talented, uh, I guess. Uh, yes, I have finally picked a good name for our new Pokemon right here, Exec or Execute. And I was actually watching Digimon, and I was like, how cool would it be if I called one of my Pokemon a Digimon name? So, say hello to Execumon right here. Execumon. Hey, it goes both ways, you know, Executor, Execute, you know, Execumon. Pretty cool Pokemon. Lacks nature, level 24, it is both grass and psychic. And it has the chlorophyll technique, which will raise its uh, speed just a little bit when it's in sunshine. As you can see, its defense is pretty good. Its special attack is right there. It has a little bit of work to do, but you know what? We can work with this. As you can see, I did give it uh, a sunny day, so it actually increased its speed. And on top of that, increased the power of mm, kind of uh, fire types and all that stuff. And look at that. It, it has two psychic attacks. So we're already rolling. Don't worry, guys. I know what I'm doing, and if you see a Beedrill right here, yes, we are going to be using Beedrill right here just to get us through some cut areas, because now it is time to go through the long and arduous path of Route 15. Yeah, I am not joking. So, oh god, Route 15, 14, all the way up to Vermilion City. Yeah, I've been dreading this day, and it, it's going to have to happen right now, guys. I get it. But this is all just to train all my Pokemon right here, just for the next few gym battles, because I'm planning on doing every single gym battle all at once. So, luckily for me, I do have a, uh, I do have a guide, so it, you know I'll I'll be able to know what Pokemon are coming out. So let's go ahead and take Executmon first, and uh, go ahead and battle whatever Pokemon we see in front of us. So as you can see, want to play with my Pokemon? Yes, I do. Let's do this. So here we go, we got ourselves Picnicker Yasmin, and she wants to come out with a Bellsprout, and we already know what type Bellsprout is, so Execumon, let's use it. Confusion. That's right, it is both a Poison and Grass type Pokemon, so it would actually help us out just a bit more right here. And uh, Crud, Sleep Powder, you gotta love that. Oh god, not a good start, but luckily for us we do have Awakenings, so hopefully we won't get like put to sleep or put a yeah put to sleep so many times so here we go Executmon you are fully awake and there's that acid attack and oh god so that that right there is powerful so let's go ahead and finish this guy off with a little bit of confusion hell yes look at that Executmon wins and it gets experience points and Poliswag is starting to learn or starting to earn, earn levels right here so we're gonna keep it right here since we're taking on another poison slash grass type Pokemon right here and uh, well let's go right ahead and get that confusional right away oh yes and it was a critical hit very good one and uh, there we go again with another sleep powder oh crap okay so I kinda have a feeling that this Oddish also has acid so let's go ahead and use that uh, full restore that we had yeah it's not yeah it, it, that way we don't faint. As you can see, I was correct. Yes, I prevented somebody from fainting, and oh, we better hit something right now before we faint. So here we go again, another confusion attack for the win. Hell yes! Oddish, defeated. Alrighty. So Executmon getting experience points, and Poliswag gaining more experience points right here. So we're going to be switching it out. Let's go with our good old buddy, Godzilla Godzilla. That's right. I said it. Godzilla. So here we go. Tangela coming out, and uh, no question whatsoever. Flamethrower for the win. Alrighty. Alrighty. See that? That's right. Oh, yes. And, uh, of course, Polyswag is not doing anything, but it's gaining levels, and it's learning moves. Hell yes! Alrighty. Okay, so we're, we're, we're doing pretty well right here. Okay. It's a good, a uh, good start to our whole thing. It's a little bit better than, uh, <laughs> you know, Patrick. That's right. So here we go, a bird type Pokemon trainer. When I whistle, I summon a bird Pokemon. Okay, that's good. 
That's very, very good for yourself, but not for me. I, I don't care. So there he is, ready, and he's coming out with his Pidgeotto. Level 26, and here comes my little Aaliyah with a Thunderbolt. Oh, yes. Oh, it's going down. All the way down. Look at that. Pidgeotto, you've been defeated. Oh, yes. And uh, Polyswag, you're continuing to grow levels right there without doing anything. Coming out with another Farfetch, or coming with the Farfetch, I'm going to just uh, do my thing right here. That's right. Oh, yes. Thunderbolt. For the win. Oh, yes. Okay. Alrighty, so we're doing good. We're doing well. And look at that, Polyswag, already at level 15. And, uh, well, let's keep Aaliyah right here and just uh, destroy every single bird Pokemon. Or flying type Pokemon. Whatever. So here we go. Thunderbolt attack for the win. Yes, sir. That's right. Oh, yes. And Polyswag doesn't gain levels for the first time in quite some time. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's bring it. Here we go, Pidgey. Let's go. Thunderbolt for the win. Oh, yes. That's right. That is how you do it right there, guys. And, uh, well, Polyswag growing to level 16. This is, uh, this is a very, very good thing right here. And, yeah, that is tragic. <laughs> okay, so let's move on forward right here. And what do you have? Hmm, my birds are shivering. Are you good? You're good, aren't you? Yes, I am. Very, very good. And, uh, he's got himself three Pokemon, and his name is Chester. What up, Chester? And he's coming out with a Dodrio, so this is going to be a good one. Let's go. Thunderbolt for the win. Alrighty. And uh, Dodrio, you have been eliminated. Alrighty. And uh, look at that. Aaliyah grows to level 32. So this is becoming a very good one right here for her. And uh, we're just going to continue on right here with Aaliyah the Pikachu. And, uh, well, let's go with Shockwave. Let's let's conserve a little bit of the Thunderbolt right here, because I know we're going to be battling a buttload of, uh, like, uh, what was it, flying-type trainers here. And as you can see, bam. There we go. Oh, yes. And Polyswag grows to level 17. And coming out with another Doe Duo? Really? You've never learned. Okay, so here we go. Look at that. Oh, yes. Shockwave. For the win, suck it, Doduo. Oh, yes. Okay. And uh, Polyswag, of course, gaining levels without even doing anything. Not an ounce of work. Okay, so I don't want to battle you yet. And, uh, yes, West of Fuchsia City. Uh, let's see. This Pokemon trainer has some uh, some uh, poison types. So let's go with Execumon right here. And uh, let's go ahead and heal it up. Okay, so, let's see, Super Potions. Alright, it still doesn't like us, but it's whatever. Hasn't got a lot of battles yet. Alright, what do you got? I just got some Pokemon in trades, can I try them out on you? Yes, you can. Okay, so, here we go. Bring it. Picnicker Kendra wants the battle, and she's coming out with a Gloom. Execumon. Digivolve to... Confusion. Really missed that show. And uh, that really do, didn't do much. And crud. Again, we're going to be put to sleep. This is this seems to be the norm right here. So, okay. I need to switch out Pokemon right here. Because this is not going to be like the last time with uh, Patrick right here. So, here we go. Godzilla, how you doing? And, of course, they wanted to use Acid. They always want to use Acid. So, Flamethrower. Oh, yes. Flamethrower for the win. And uh, say goodbye to Gloom. That's right. No Gloom. No Gloom. And uh, Executumon gets points. Polyswag grows to level 18. And uh, you know what? We're gonna continue on right here with Godzilla because yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to have Executumon faint right here. So once Polyswag evolves into Poliwhirl, Poliwhirl, yes, Poliwhirl. Then yes, we will be giving that experience share to uh, po to Executumon. But uh, right now, I'd rather not risk getting acid all over my, 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 my Pokemon right here. So, here we go again. Flamethrower for the win. Oh, yes. There we go. And that is how you do it, peoples. That is how you do it. And, uh, well, Polyswag doesn't get anything. But he's like, not good enough. 
Probably because you're not very familiar with these Pokemon right here. So let's go right ahead and uh, awaken our Pokemon yet again. Because I guess that seems to be the norm. And uh, hopefully this next trainer has some better Pokemon. I raise Pokemon for protection because I live alone. Really? Okay, that's a good, uh, that is a good, good idea right there. So here we have Beauty Olivia coming out with a Bulbasaur. Kind of have a feeling that they're going to put me to sleep too. Oh, you suck. Here we go, Confusion. Nope, going with the Razor Leaf. And, uh, well, not very effective. Okay, so here we go. It's still a Poison-type Pokemon right here. And uh, it takes a nice chunk out of its HP, so we're going to do it again. Confusion. Alrighty. Okay, and, uh, really? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. We're really gonna do this. What move could you have? Okay. Oh, man. Okay, so... Yeah. Executmon has fallen asleep how many times in this game alone? You are horrible. Oh my god. Oh my god, I really... Uh, yeah, whatever. Of course it has to happen right here, of course, and uh, well, let's go with the Thrash. You know what, let's finish off both these Pokemon with Thrashes. So there we go, Bulbasaur, you've been defeated, Executmon, you've been redeemed, and Poliswag, you grow to level 19 and you learn Double Slap, and uh, coming out with another Ivysaur. So let's go right ahead and use that Thrash. You're not going to have a chance to hit me right now. Not one chance, well maybe one. Ah crud. Okay, so we might be confused. Okay, we got one more Thrash in us. And uh, there you go. Ivysaur eliminated. Alrighty. Okay. Alrighty, so... Yeah, we've fallen asleep so many friggin' times against these god dang grass-type Pokemon. It's, it's ridiculous. Oh my god. Okay, so there we go. Executmon, you are awake, and here we go with another super potion because you like to hog them all, you asshole. Okay, and uh, well, now let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. We got ourselves another bird type Pokemon trainer on his way, and uh, well, I don't know, right here. Oh, you're a little cutie, so like a, a darling Pokemon. Okay. Alrighty, so here we go. Bring it. Beauty Grace would like to battle, and she's coming with a Pidgeotto. I will be here with Aaliyah. Alright, Aaliyah. Do your stuff. Thunderbolt. You know, I think I've been doing pretty well. These Pokemon are well within the levels. And all that stuff, and I am struggling kind of a bit, you know. But still, I have a certain, uh, you know, thing that I, you know, I like to, I like to be on top. I like to... I like to win and all that stuff. So we're gonna be going up against a Wigglytuff here, and uh, hopefully, hopefully we uh, do something to it. So here's Wigglytuff, and then I'm gonna switch out because I know for a fact they're gonna try and do something stupid by putting my Pokemon to sleep. So let's go, Thrasher, and uh, nope, it's a Defense Curl. Alrighty, alright, let's go, Brick Break. Alrighty, and there we go. Does it go? Yes, it does. Alrighty. Okay. And uh, there goes Wigglytuff, and uh, everybody else gets experience points, including Executmon. And, uh, well, that was a easy battle, I guess. Alright, so this next battle might be a little risky, just because uh, Executmon is weak to Poison-type Pokemon. So, we're gonna have to... We're just gonna have to risk it. So, here we go. Battling up against this guy. A, uh, yeah, a biker, and he is coming with his uh, coughing. All right, Executmon, don't bitch out and do this right. Confusion attack. All righty. And uh, that takes a nice chunk. All righty, and uh, crud. Here we go with a sludge, and it is powerful as hell. Okay, finish him off. Okay. So that, like, like I said, it was a little bit risky going up against these guys, but we're getting some experience points right here. So he's coming out with another Grimer, so I'm going to stay and then switch out my Pokemon right here. And, uh, well, let's see. Who is the next Pokemon to go? You know what? Let's go with Godzilla. Alrighty. Bring it. Just bring it. And uh, coming out with the Disable. Yeah, that was going to do me some damage right there, so let's go. Oh, crud. Really? 
Well, look at that. Okay. So let's go again. Mega Punch, hopefully for the win. And, uh, takes a good one. And there's that sludge attack that we don't want. Okay, and let's see, let's see. Flamethrower. Let's get this. Alrighty, Flamethrower gets it. Alrighty, Grimer, you, 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 you're a tough Pokemon right there. Alrighty, and uh, he's coming out with the Weezing, so let's go with Poliswag right here. I know, it's a risk, but think of the experience points, guys. Lots and lots of experience points right here. Alright, it knows hypnosis. Crud, doesn't put it to sleep. Crud. Well, I tried. Damn it! Uh, okay, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get pissed off. Damn you, poison type Pokemon! I hate you all. Alrighty, let's see. Um, where's a revive? <laughs> of course, I only bought. I only have one revive. Ah, oh, jeez. I came in prepared. Really, really prepared. Wow. Okay, so that really doesn't do much, but, hold on, just a sec. Let's go right ahead and use Rock Slide. Let's just destroy this guy. Finish him. Alrighty. And, uh, the Weezing, still doing a sludge attack, not very effective, and, uh, oh god. Freaking Rock Slide. What, 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 what is it with these Rock-type moves being so inaccurate? It's so freaking, it's so freaking annoying. Oh my god. And then, there we go. And another smog attack, really? Oh god, okay. Alrighty. I see what this is. I see what this is, okay. So, thrash attack. Let's get that, alrighty. And uh, there you go. Defeated. And uh, look at that, Polyswag grows to level 21. And, uh, well, I, I guess that does it for us right there. So, uh, yeah. This is awesome. I completely forgot to bring some extra items, and it looks like we're not going to survive very much if we keep on doing this, what we're doing. It's annoying. Okay, so the next guy right here has plenty of coughings and a lot of wheezing, so... Yeah, this guy is going to be a tough one. So he's like, hey, hey kid, come on! I just got off the... Oh, wait, 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 I just got these off some loser. Okay. So he is a stealer, a robber, a, uh... Whatever. <laughs> Alright, so Biker Ernest is coming here, waiting to battle, and I'm gonna go with Execumon. Alrighty. Let's go, Confusion. Come on, make him faint. Okay, nearly makes him faint. And he's confused, okay. Thank you, baby Arceus. Come on, hurt yourself. Hurt yourself. Yes! Oh, thank you. Okay, so we got one more chance onto this guy. Okay. We're finally winning something. We're finally going somewhere, I think. And uh, there you go. And uh, Poly Swag getting some experience points. So let's continue on right here. Let's go, Execumon. Let's do this. Right here, confusion attack. There we go. Not confused. And uh, the smug attack. Oh, this ought to be fun. <laughs> this ought to be fun right here, guys. Uh, super effective, and look at that. I got poisoned! <laughs> oh my god. Oh, you suck, coughing. You suck, bloody dick. Oh my god. This is some tough times right here. And uh, we gain experience points. Polyswag grows to level 22. And he's coming out with the wheezing. So I'm going to stay. I know I'm risking it, but this is for the experience points. I want to get to at least level 25. And, uh... Alrighty, let's go. Let's go to Godzilla right here. I have a, I have a feeling that I'm gonna get poisoned again. Nope, just a smoke screen. Alrighty, I, 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 I can do this. I can do this. Fly or flamethrower will do this. Alrighty, and uh, there you go. Wheezing is no more. Freaking wheezing, I swear to god. And uh, look at that. Execumon finally grows to level 25 and it's learning Stun Spore. Uh, let's see, what kind of uh, moves does it have? Huh. Yeah, it only has one attack. So I'm gonna take away Reflect. Not much I can do right there. And there we go, Stun Spore. Should help us for a little bit. And, uh, okay, so he's coming out with the copying. And uh, let's go straight to Aaliyah right here. 
and see if we can do something with this. Alrighty. Come on, bring it. Thunderbolt. Okay. There we go. And there you go. Coughing has been defeated. Thanks to Aaliyah right here. And uh, he's coming out with the grammar. So let's just stay with Aaliyah. And hopefully we don't screw up right here. So let's go Thunderbolt for the win. Okay. There we go. And uh, good God. Thunderbolt has been disabled. So let's go right ahead and uh, use that shockwave right here. Alrighty. Alrighty. There we go. And that is how you take care of a Grimer right there. And uh, that's pretty much it right there. Oh, okay. I'll see how it is. I'll see how it is. Okay, so let's see. Do I have an antidote? A spare antidote in my pockets right now? Of course I don't. Oh, there it is. Okay, so I bought quite a few antidotes right here. Of course, Executmon has to be poisoned and all that stuff, and I can't really heal it. So what we're going to do right now is I'm going to go off screen. I'm going to buy myself a few items. I'll be right back right in front of this guy right here. So I'll be right back, guys. Alrighty guys, so I'm back after a good while. Yes, I know. Uh, so off screen, I did buy a few items, and you know what? I decided that I needed to train just a little bit more for all these people, just so I can get rid of this episode quick, as quickly as possible. As you can see, some of my Pokemon have grown, especially Executmon. I have been battling quite a few people off screen with the VS Seeker, so now, uh, hopefully this will make it a little bit easier for us to go through this whole area. Now, I do have the chance to actually evolve Executmon right now, but I kind of want to wait until after we defeat all these trainers, get it to a good level. I know that the next main move that it could learn is Solar Beam. And uh, you know what? I'm just going to wait for that. I'm not going to just rush it into evolution. So let's go right ahead and battle some more trainers. Hopefully we have better luck than uh, this person right here. So here we are in Route 14 now. And uh, hopefully, well, this person right here probably has a Clefairy. So let's see. I could be wrong. No, actually... I'm not wrong. I'm gonna go right here. So we're in this section right here. And uh, we're gonna be battling quite a few trainers up here, especially finding an item that we probably need later on. So here we are, Route 15, and here is a trainer. You look gentle, so I think I can beat you. I'll give it a go. Do I really look that gentle? Do I? Do I sound gentle? I don't think so. So here we go. Picnicker Becky wants the battle. She's coming with her Pikachu. I'm coming with Thrasher. Okay, Rock Slide. Let's get this going right here. Oh, yes. Pikachu, you have been destroyed. Look at that. Pikachu getting its butt kicked and Poliswag growing levels like crazy. And here she comes out with the Raichu. So I'm going to go straight for Thrasher again and we're going to dig this time. Oh, yes. You cannot hit me. I will not be defeated this way. And, uh, well, he's trying to tail whip me. And, uh, no quick attack right there. Look at that. Two attacks at once. Still missed. And there's that dig attack. You have been defeated. Alrighty. And, uh, look at that. Easy battle. Easy freaking battle. If it was just like, if, if, if it was this easy every single time, then maybe I would just, like, you know, continue. But it is what it is, guys. Okay, so. Let's see, we got a double battle right here, so let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Um, let's see, you know what, I'm going to go with Godzilla as coverage and uh, just battle these guys. So let's see, you're perfect, help me train with my little brother. Okay, let's see what we got. So here we go, Crushkin, Ron and Maya would like to battle and they're coming out with both Hitmonchan and Hitmonlee right here. Well, I got Executmon and Godzilla, so we got two good Pokemon against two good Pokemon. Um, uh, you know what? I'm going to go straight for the confusion onto you, and uh, you know what? Screw it to this guy. We're going to hit one person at a time, because more than likely this Hitmonchan might have like a fire punch, and uh, there's that brick break. How do you brick break with legs? I want to know. And uh, <laughs> I was right, but he hit the wrong person right there. So here we go, confusion for the win. That's right. That's how you do that. Oh yes, that's how you do that. And uh, well, let's see. Confusion onto you. 
And, uh, well, let's go with Flamethrower to you. So, here we go, Flamethrower. Does it do it? Will it do it? Can it do it? Oh my god, nearly does it. And crud, there's that Brick Break. Not so effective right now. So, Executumon, you have been saved, but here we go. Confusion, final touches. Alrighty. Okay, so my Pokemon are doing well now, now that it's a little bit trained. <coughs> Excuse me, I've been sneezing. So, Poliswag grows to level 24. And uh, there we go, King Crush, King Crush, uh, whatever his name is, has been defeated. And, uh, well, let's see. We got one more person right here. And, uh, let's see. I believe this person right here does have a Clefairy, so let's go right ahead and switch him out. Let's go with Thrasher. Alrighty. Thrasher the Pokemon. But before we do that, let's grab this. The TM-18 Rain Dance. Very good move for electric and water type Pokemon. And here we go. What's cool and happening? Trading Pokemon. Yes, they are. Maybe. I don't even know. Alrighty. So here we go. We're battling up against Clefairy right here. And uh, Thrasher looking like a beast right here out of hell. Going with that Brick Break. Oh, yes. And, uh, well, there we go. No more Clefairy. That is how you do it right there, guys. And, uh, well, Celia doing their thing, and she's like, I, I said trade. <laughs> okay, so that's done for those people right there. Now it is time to go straight to Route 14 and uh, battle all these people because, uh, yeah, why not? This is a long, long freaking adventure, guys. It really is. And, uh, oh, God. Okay, so... We got a team battle right here. And, uh, well, let's go switch right here with this guy. And, uh, you know what? Polyswag needs a little bit of a battle. I want to I wanna see what it, what, it do, what it can do right here. So let's go against the twins. Jan, truly, or wait, wait, wait. Jan, let's truly, or let's try really, really hard together. Okay. Bring it. So here we go. Going up against twins, Kiri and Jan, and they're coming out with Charmander and Squirtle right here. And uh, I think I got the right Pokemon for this. My two newest Pokemon. Hopefully they do well. Let's go with uh, Confusion to you, and uh, let's go with a Bubble or Water Gun to you. So there we go, Water Gun. Super effective. That's right. And uh, well, you gotta love that scary face. You have to. I mean. You have to love Scary Face because it harshly uh, ruins the 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 the, the duodenum, I should say. <laughs> okay, so that's right. Water Absorb. It uses it. <laughs> okay, so let's use Confusion and Water Gun onto this guy, and of course he likes to use Smoke Screen. A whole Pokemon. Okay, so let's go Confusion. Alrighty, and uh, there we go with the Water Gun. Come on, finish him, and that's how you do it. Okay, so now it's again it's two against one right here, and uh, well, there's that bite attack, and uh, yeah, it's definitely it's definitely gonna go against me right there. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna switch, I'm gonna switch Pokemon right here. Let's go with Aaliyah, and uh, well, let's double slap it. So there we go, Aaliyah, how you doing? Double slap, come on! Oh God. Just two, just just double slap. It's going off its namesake right there, and uh, there you go. You're paralyzed, you a-hole Pokemon. All right, it is time to use a shockwave, and uh, you can't move, buddy. <laughs> so there we go, shockwave for the win. Oh yes, and that is how you do it right there, guys. Look at that. Very easy, very very easy. Okay, all right. Yeah, you guys lost. You guys lost. Okay, so let's see. Um, we got another bird type Pokemon trainer here. So let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon now. Let's go straight to Aaliyah right here. Let's make it easy as possible. Let's work smarter, not harder. And uh, I'm not into it, but okay, let's go. If you're not into it, then why are you doing it? That's what I want to know. So here we go. Bird Keeper Banny wants the battle, and he's coming with his Spearow right here. And Aaliyah, the Destroyer. Alrighty, Shockwave for the win. Let's get it. Oh yes. Oh yes. Super effective. Alrighty, okay. Everybody's kicking some butt right here. And uh, coming out with the Fero, I think I know what to do right here. 
All right, you can't destroy me. So here we go, Thunderbolt. Let's get it. All righty, Thunderbolt does it, and there goes Firo. All righty, okay, look at that. And Polyswag grows to level 25. Always good, and it's trying to learn Rain Dance. Huh? What are the odds? Okay, so let's go ahead and take away. Let's take away Bubble for the time being. Because uh, I got a little something planned for this guy right here. So there we go. It learns Rain Dance and uh, no more Bird Keeper Benny. Okay. All right. And uh, would you look at that? Polyswag is finally evolving. It only took us like maybe, I don't know, 24 minutes or 25 minutes. But here it is, guys. The actual Pokemon that I wanted on my team before Patrick ruined it all in the last episode. There you go. Say hello to Poliwhirl right here. Look at this Pokemon. It's looking pretty beastly right now. Okay, so now that it has arms, as you can see, it is capable of a little bit more than that, okay? Once it evolves into a Poliwhirl or a Poliwrath, then boom, that's when it becomes a fighting type Pokemon. As you can see, it is a little bit faster, its defense is up there, its a offensive scheme right there, it's, it's still right there, it's even out. Not the best, but you know, with the right kind of moves, you can actually make this Pokemon work. Uh, let's see. Now that I think about it, let's go ahead and teach it... Let's go ahead and teach it Surf right here. For the time being. I may switch it here and there. Uh, okay, so it does have Rain Dance now, so we don't need Water Gun. Look at that. Okay, and uh, it learns Surf. Okay, alrighty. And then, uh, let's see, I could teach it Psychic right now, but that would be a little bit moot right now. So let's go ahead and give it Brick Break as well, because it will become a Fighting-type Pokemon once it evolves again. So let's go take out Double Slap right here. Alrighty. Look at that. All these skills are just being given. Look at that. Polyswag, you are looking legit. Okay, and then Aerial Ace. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, so not many Pokemon learn that secret power you know what I'm gonna give this let's see let's see if Executmon can learn this let's see secret power all right let's see it is a uh, wonder if I can see if it's a uh, okay so uh, you know what let's just keep it at that let's just keep it at that eventually I'll learn another move I don't really need to teach it or need to rush into it um let's see I could teach it Psychic. That could work, but I kind of want to give it to uh, Polyswag just in case. Uh, but then again, oh god. Yeah, we'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Let's see. Um, return to a physical attacker right here. And uh, we got Hyper Beam Light Screen. And uh, yeah, okay. So you know what? Let's leave it at that right now. Okay, and then uh, since that is going on, let's take away... Let's take away the experience share and give it to our good old buddy, a good old buddy, uh, whatchamacallit, Executmon, because it probably is going to need it just a little bit more, and uh, everybody else can just battle at, at will and stuff. So let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon right now. Okay, so there we go. Oh, look at that. Executmon is finally loving me. Okay, so you are healed up, and... Uh, Okay, so who is next right here? So we got E right there. Okay, so let's just go ahead and take on this bird trainer right here. And uh, have you heard of the legend of the wing mirages? He's probably taking on. He's probably talking about the legendary bird Pokemon that we've been hearing about. So here you go, Bird Keeper Donald wants the battle, and he's coming with his far fetched. And uh, alrighty, Leah, Shockwave, both at level 33. Very good levels right there, and uh, alrighty, Farfetch'd, you you are you are a tank right here. You are wow, and it is a very physical attacker. So here we go again, Shockwave. Let's get this. That's right. Okay, alrighty. There you go, and uh, Executmon is getting points for not doing anything at all. Seriously, guys, I can literally evolve Executmon right now if I wanted to. Um, so, let's go right ahead and... Uh, okay, so what kind of Pokemon do these guys have? Um, yeah, we got Poison-type Pokemon right here. 
lots and lots of poison type Pokemon. Okay, so I've made the decision. This is it. Let's go right ahead and uh, evolve Executmon. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. We know where to find uh, Solar Beam later on right here. So let's give this to Executmon. Alrighty, Leaf Stone has been used. What? Executmon is evolving! Executmon, Digivolve to... Executor Mon. <laughs> I kind of wanted to call it Brawly, but then again, like, you know, Brawly's badass, and this guy right here is like... Yeah. <laughs> so here we go, Executmon, Executor. Look at that, it looks like a beast. Alrighty, so... Let's see. We have a leaf. Oh, we have another leaf stone. Just yeah, we we had it for that occasion. So, hopefully, this will actually give Executmon a little bit more power or a little bit more juice. So as you can see, it's both a grass and psychic type Pokemon, and its special attack has gone through the roof now. It is more of a physical or a special attacker, and hopefully, this will actually help us out just a little bit when we take on these guys. So let's go ahead and try this guy out. We ride out here because of the wide open spaces. Alrighty. See what you got. So here we go. Biker Gerald wants the battle, and he's coming with his coughing right here. Executmon looking like a beast. Or I guess kind of looking like a beast. So here we go. Confusion. Come on. And it does. Holy crap. Okay. Alright, so we're working with something. Look at that. Executmon going up against a muck here. Seeing if we don't we don't faint too quickly. So here we go. Confusion for the win, hopefully. And, wow, okay, alrighty. And uh, we're going to be taking a sludge attack right here. And uh, that takes half our, or almost half our HP. And look at that, we got poisoned again. Wow, you got to love that. Okay, so here we go. Confusion, let's get it. And that is how you do it, guys. Alrighty, alright, alright. Okay, so uh, it's a wipeout. Pokemon are... Whatever, okay. So let's go right ahead and uh, heal up our Executmon. We got poisoned yet again. <sighs> Looks like to me that we don't need to be uh, worried. We don't have to be worried about... Uh... Yeah, we don't have to be worried about paralysis because we just keep on getting poisoned every friggin' time. Alright, so here we go. Giving that HP and uh, let's battle this guy who's riding along. Alright, what do you got? Come on, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go! Okay. Okay, so here we go. Biker Lucas would like to battle. And he's got himself coughing. Alrighty, so these look like easy Pokemon for the picking. Alrighty. Confusion. Alrighty. Look at that. Does it do it? Yes, it does. Okay, so I think I picked the right Pokemon. Instead of freaking Patrick right here. And look at that. Executmon grows to level 31. And it's trying to learn Egg Bomb. Wow, okay, so I picked the right stuff. And this is a very powerful attack, so let's go ahead and take away Leech Seed. Don't worry, guys. We'll be using that a little bit later on. So there we go, Leech Seed taken away, and here we have Egg Bomb. All right, bring on the next guy. He's coming out with another coughing. I'm feeling powerful. Oh, yes. Very, very powerful. So here we go, Confusion Attack. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, Executmon, where have you been all my life? And he's coming out with the Grimer. Oh my god. I made the right choice. I made the right choice, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Evil. I'm just an evil, evil person right now. This is vengeance for all the stupid shit that happened to me in Cycling Road. Oh yes. Bayback time. Draven style. Oh yes. Executmon, you are a beast! Okay, so uh, to me it kind of feels like it doesn't need a uh, psychic. Or I, I, I just might be talking out of my ass right now, but you know what? Uh, <laughs> okay, well, let's just destroy these guys. Yes, this is payback for all the crap that I had to endure in Cycling Road. All the crap. Okay. Bring on your coughings, because they will not touch my Executmon. 
I'm really liking this right now, guys. I really am. <laughs> so there we go. Confusion. Yeah, buddy. What now? Oh, yes. Getting experience points up the butt. Yeah, buddy. Oh, yeah. Nobody can touch this. Here we go. Confusion again. Dumbass psychic or dumbass as poison type Pokemon. Look at that. Oh, yes. They're getting creamed left and right. These coconuts had had enough. This is for all the crap that Patrick put me through. All the crap. He's like, I need to burn some time. Shut up and battle. Whatever you say, homeboy. Whatever you say. So here we go. Another battler. And he's his name is Isaac. And here we go with the Grimer. Alrighty. Okay, Grimer. You're gonna feel the burn of uh, Exekumon's Confusion Ray. <laughs> oh, man. You don't know how good this feels, guys. You really don't know. I mean, the crap I endured in the last episode, I can already hear you guys laughing at me. And I know one of you guys have counted the amount of times I got poisoned and the amount of times I got revived. It was annoying. So this this is making it all up. It really is. And uh, yeah, buddy, that's how you do it. Oh, yes, Execumon is just killing it. Oh, yes. Level 32 Execumon. Going with the confusion. Alrighty. And. Uh, <laughs> oh, man, this feels good. This feels right. So I think I made the right choice. Yeah, buddy. Suck it. Okay, so that is that for those guys. Now we are going to have to go straight up right here because we still got more trainers to battle. And uh, you know what? Execumon doesn't look like it needs the the experience share anymore because it's like my second probably my it's getting up there in levels So let's go right ahead and switch him out right here Let's go give the experience share back to polyswag and you know, let's level him up just a little bit So let's see uh, Let's go back to Aaliyah And let's just destroy everybody. Let's destroy everybody. Have you taught your Pokemon how to fly? Yes, I have You'll be able to soar into the sky. I know. Okay. So here we go. Bird Keeper Marlin wants the battle, and he's coming with his Spiro. Okay, Spiro, how you doing? And uh, here we go. The Shockwave Palooza. Alrighty. Alrighty. So I'm looking. Uh, I'm looking like a like a thousand bucks right here. That's right. Look at that. Kicking your, kicking all you guys' butts. So he's coming out with a Doe Duo, and uh, okay, let's go again, another Shockwave. Man, does it feel good to win again. <laughs> oh my god. I could evolve Leo right now if I wanted to, but I really don't. She doesn't want me to evolve her her, uh, her Pikachu just yet. And uh, well, let's just bring it on again with a Thunderbolt right here. Okay. There we go. Alrighty. And uh, there you go. Eat it, Firo. Alright, Aaliyah's kicking butt, and uh, yeah! Look at that, we're winning! It's finally working. The plan is freaking working. Okay. So that's one guy down, and uh, this guy has two Pokemon. So let's go right ahead and switch him out to Thrasher. Polyswag is just going to sit by and take some HP because, you know, why not? They have TMs on sale at the Celadon City store. TMs aren't really rare, but not as many have not as many people have HMs. Oh, I kind of do have a lot of HMs right here. Alrighty, let's go. Bring it. Let's see what you got right here. So, Pidgeotto versus Thrasher, and uh, well, we got Rock Slide. Should work out properly for us, right? And uh, look at that, Pidgeotto has been defeated. Ha 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 ha. Alrighty. And, uh, well, he's coming out with a Fero, so let's go ahead and take care of this guy with another Rock Slide Palooza right here. Rock Slides. Oh, yes. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Fero defeated. Okay, alrighty. And, uh, Polyswag, level 26? Alrighty. Everybody is growing, everything is going well. This is a complete opposite from the last time. Yeah, complete opposite. Okay, so. We got more trainers up here. Shouldn't be that hard. I think they're all bird type trainers. My bird Pokemon should be ready for battle. They should, but they're not. 
They really aren't. So here we go, another bird keeper, and his name is Mitch, and he's coming out with his PGs. Oh god. You know, I really do hate the Pokemon trainers with like five Pokemon of the same type. It's really annoying. And uh, yeah buddy, that's how you take it out. Alrighty. Okay. Alright, let's 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 just do this. Let's just destroy him with Feroes or with rock slides. That's right, you can't destroy this. Thrasher. Destructive. Alrighty. Alrighty. And uh well, he's coming out with the Pidgey. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. Let's give Aaliyah a little bit of love in two. Huh. As far as I'm concerned right now, my Pokemon are getting up there in strength and they look like they're ready to take on Erica the Gym Leader. Now, we have endured a lot of episodes, a lot of changes, a lot of Pokemon guys, and I think I'm starting to see like a I'm starting to see like a change in my team, a very good dynamic, if you will. And uh like I said, there will be a little bit more changes to the team uh, later on when we get into like the Sevi Islands and all that stuff. Uh, in the Sevi Islands, I actually am unable to get some of my uh, Johto Pokemon, so just keep an eye out for that one too because I might you might be seeing some of the Johto Pokemon. I mean like Relic, Lucky, you know, that kind of stuff. And here we have uh, another Burt Pokemon trainer. You need to use TMs to teach good moves for Pokemon. Yeah, well, you don't say. Okay. So here we have another bird keeper, and he's got himself three Pokemon. Let's do this. Let's bring it. Okay. He's got himself a Pidgey. I got myself Rock Slides. Alrighty. And uh, that was an easy victory right there. Okay, alrighty. Okay, and uh, well, let's see. He's going to come out with a Doduo. Both my Pokemon need to let get to level 34, so... Let's go right ahead and go with another Rock Slide. No damage done for me. Oh yes, look at that. So easy, easy victories. And look at that, Thrasher finally grows to level 34. And uh, well, there's one more Pokemon right here, so let's give that to Aaliyah and give it uh, a nice, a nice welcoming present right here for this Pokemon right here. Let's see, got your Pidgeotto. Let's go with a Thunderbolt right here. Oh damn, you are paralyzed because you went quick. You went quick. Alrighty. So here we go. Using that Thunderbolt. Does it do it? Will it do it? Yes, it does. Hell yes. Look at that. And uh, Polyswag grows to level 27. Aaliyah grows to level 34. That is great. Oh my god. Okay, alrighty. I'm liking this. I am liking this. Heck yes. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Um, I'm pretty sure we have another trainer with like six Pokemon right here. Uh, let's see. Most of my Pokemon are at level 30. That's good. And uh, I'm going to try and heal them up right now. Don't worry, guys. We are... Well, we, we got a little bit more of this episode to go through. <laughs> a little bit more. Don't worry. Uh, let's just... Uh, Hey, like, hey, uh, bear with me right here, guys. I know, I know. This is what I've been trying to do for Pokemon Leaf Green for quite some time, guys. So, let's go ahead and talk to this guy right here. We are in Route 13, and Homeboy here is like, I'm not going to lose, not when it, the wind's blowing my way. Okay, whatever you say. Alrighty, so, let's see what we got. Bird Keeper Perry coming with something. I don't know. Okay, so Shockwave. Try not to dun not, not to waste uh, a lot of my moves right here. So there we go. There we go. Spiro defeated. Alrighty. Alrighty, look at that. Pokemon are doing well. Loving it. I'm gonna keep it right there. Alrighty. Alright, just bring it right here. Here we go. Quick attack. And I'm gonna go straight for the shockwave right here. Alrighty. Okay. Look at that! That's right. That's how you do it right there. Destroying everybody. And uh, let's see, he's gonna come out with another Pidgey. So I'm gonna stick with uh, I'm gonna stick with this little guy, this little gal right here. And I'm gonna go straight for another Shockwave. And uh, alrighty, look at that. Look at that. Easy victory. Easy, easy, easy. And uh, let's see, he's coming out with a Spearow. So let's go ahead and take. 
Like, let's just leave it like that, okay? So let's go another shockwave. Hopefully this does the trick right here. And, uh, bam! That is how you do it. Alrighty, alrighty. Look at that. Yeah, buddy. Okay. And, uh, let's go ahead and stay. Let's stay with the Leo for a little bit more. Just destroy everybody with the Leo. Get those experience points and just move on. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Yeah, so my Pokemon are doing well now. It's a complete 180 from the last episode. Trust me, guys. Last episode was bad. It was really bad, and I don't ever want to think about it ever again. Well, I'm pretty sure many of you guys are still laughing about it. It's okay, guys. You can still laugh. You can laugh. It's all right. All right, so let's move on right here. And, uh... Wow, we got a lot of trainers. See, this is the... Uh, this part right here and the self co are one of the two annoying places that I've ever had to go through. Mainly because of the amount of trainers that they're that, that, that are by, but I get it. I know why they're there. It's for the training. Uh, it's doing me wonders right now with my new team, and, uh, well, I mean, what can I say? What can I say? Like, you can't really, you can't really, uh, hate something that will benefit you. It's like... It, you know, it's kind of like when your parents give you a little bit of a lecture that you don't want to believe in, and then eventually you find out that, yeah, wow, they're, they're right. They're right all along, and you just don't want to admit it. Well, here you are. You're, you're hearing me admit to this thing right here. Oh, damn. And, uh, well, Executumon is just destroying everybody right here. I'm loving it. Oh, my God. This is... This... This, this right here. This is what I wanted. Pure and utter chaos. Oh yes, everybody's being destroyed, everybody's being defeated, look at that. And yeah, he's been stripped of the gears, okay! Alrighty, so... Lexi, um... Kinda wanna use Poliswag, but kinda feel like there's another bird-type trainer around here, like down there. Uh, let's see, now that's Route 14, so let's go right ahead and move a little bit further right here. Uh, let's see, yes, there are some trainers right here, like three or four more trainers. Let's go ahead and battle this guy. Alright. Bring it. Bring it. Just bring it. Whew! Okay, so here we have another bird keeper. His name is Robert. He thinks he's tight. But in the down low, he really sucks. Okay, so Thrasher. Let's go with the Thrash attack. Alrighty. So let's go. You got poisoned. So there we go with a Thrash attack right here. And, uh, yeah, buddy. That's one down. Alrighty, and Poliswag grows to level 28, and, uh, well, yeah, I did say that I can evolve Poliswag right now, but I kind of don't want to. Uh, I just checked its level. The level, they, well, I just checked, uh, the, the kind of moves that it learns during the levels. Kind of want to wait till level 35, because when it gains to, well, when it gets to level 35, it not only learns Body Slam, but if you evolved it, if you evolve it into a uh, Poliwhirl, or a Poliwrath, it will actually learn Submission as well, and that is an actual move that we need to. So, we're just going to keep it like that, wait for it just a little bit, we're not going to rush into it like Patrick. Yeah, we're really not going to ru rush into it like Patrick anymore. Screw that! Here we go, Thrash Attack. Alrighty. Alright. That's right. Look at that. And, uh, Firo is coming out. Okay. Alright, Firo. I don't like you. You really don't like me. Alrighty. And, uh, that is not how you do it. Ah, oh, crud. Okay. And, yes, you just got poison, you asshole Pokemon, you. So, there we go. Poisoned. Hurt a little more. And there we go. Thrash attack. For the win. Alrighty. Okay. Look at that. Everything is working, guys. Everything is working. So for those who were laughing at me in the last episode, you can go suck it. <laughs> I'm just playing, guys. Okay. So let's let's go right ahead and use Poliswag. I kind of want to test him out right now. Hopefully it gives me good luck right here. So let's see. My cute Pokemon wish to make your acquaintance. Okay. Alrighty. Let's go. Alrighty. So... Here we go, Pidgey versus Poliswag. Poliswag's first battle right here, and we're gonna start off with the Rain Dance right here, because we need to power up our, our water type moves. We need to make us uh, super strong and everything. Don't worry, we're not a fighting type Pokemon just yet. That's right, 
the rain continues to fall. Alright, let's go, surf! Oh yes, surf attack. Alrighty, okay, look at that! Look at that, Polyswag's keeping its own right there, and uh, we're gonna be going up against a Meowth right here. We all know that Meowths do not like water, just like cats. And uh, let's go with a Brick Break right here. Look at that. Oh yes. Oh yeah, Meowth defeated. Okay, alrighty. And uh, all right, Pidgey, you wanna you wanna another one right here too, huh? And uh, the rain continues to fall. Alrighty, let's continue with this onslaught right here of uh of water water moves. There we go, surf attack. And uh, there we go. No more Pidgey. That's right. Look at that. And he's coming out with a Pidgeotto, or she's coming out with a Pidgeotto. I always get those two wrong. And uh, yes, the rain continues to fall. Okay. Let's make this a big, 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 big destruction of a of a Pidgeotto. And Crud, using Wing Attack, takes advantage of that. Let's go with a Surf and Crud. This Pidgeotto is like, he got a few good moves on me. So here we go, Surf Attack. Yeah, buddy. Alrighty. And look at that, Polyswag, level 29. Alrighty. Okay, everything's going well right here. Fuck yeah, okay, all right, right on. All right, so we got more trainers right here. Believe it or not, guys, lots and lots of trainers. We're gonna be done until we get to the area where we got the super potion, so we're gonna be here for quite some time, guys. An hour and a half or something. So if you're still here with me, thank you. Thank you guys for watching. I mean, thank you very for bearing with me with all the crazy stuff that I do. I mean, uh, yeah. I mean, uh, I couldn't do this without you guys, so thank you guys for continuing to watch all my walkthroughs. And here we go, Poliwag versus Poliswag. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and uh, switch out our Pokemon. Actually, you know what? Screw it. Let's do it. Break, break. For the win. Oh, yes. And it takes a nice chunk and... Wow. Okay. Okay, you're doing it for us right here. But that's not the move that I wanted you to do. And of course, you will not be hurting me with any water type attack. I don't think I would be able to hurt that one with, with water type attacks either. So there we go. And a double slap fails right there. Okay. Alrighty. So let's go. Brick break. Get it. Oh, yes. There goes that poly swag. Alrighty. And uh, coming out with another one. So let's just continue right here with poly swag. And. Uh, Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, oh, jeez. It's a long battle right here. Now, I could have used Pikachu, but... No. And, uh, okay. So, you're coming out with a double slap right here. Doesn't work whatsoever. So, let's go ahead and uh, do this. Brick, brick. For the win. Ah, oh, damn it. And, uh, yes. Water Absorb does us a trick right there. And we're going to continue on right here with a Water Break. Or Brick Break, I should say. And, uh... There we go. More experience points! This is always nice. This is very, very nice. Okay, so we got two more trainers right here. And, uh... This should be easy right here for me. So here they go. Do you want to battle some Pokemon with me? Yes, I do. Let's do this. Uh, I gotta stretch out just a little bit. Uh, okay, there we go. Here we go. Beauty Sheila coming out with, uh... Her Clefairy. Okay, and uh, let's go right ahead and use this Brick Break right here. Oh, yes. And, uh, yes. Yeah, buddy. All right. See that? <laughs> okay. All right, Polyswag. Getting experience points. Kick it some ass right here. So here we go. Brick Break for the win. Look at that. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. No more Brick Break, or no more uh, Meowth right there. And uh, nearly grows to level 30. Wow. Holy crud. Nearly did that. Okay. Last trainer right here. And uh, sure, I'll play with you, sweetie. Whatever you say, homegirl. Let's do this. Let's go. So here we go. Beauty Lola would like to battle, and she will be coming out with her Raditos right here. So, Polly Swag, let's do this. Continue with the Brick Breaks until your arms fall off again. Alrighty, alrighty, okay. Look at that. Look at that, and hello, level 30. 
Look at that. Okay, so it's come, she's coming out with a Pikachu. Let's go with... No, not that Pokemon. Let's go with Thrasher right here. I almost wanted to use Executimon. I really did. Okay. Alrighty, so bring out that Pikachu. Let's go with that Dig Attack. Oh, yes. Look at that. Dug a hole. Dug a real big hole. And crud! It is using Double Team. Okay. So that is a that that, that could prove uh, that that could be a problem for us, but no, it is not. As you can see, that's right. Dig attack does it, and uh, no, I don't get paralyzed. Yeah, buddy. Okay, and uh, you know what? Let's keep it right here. Let's go with Thrasher, and uh, let's go with that Brick Break right here. Eventually, I'm gonna have to teach Thrasher a new move aside from Brick Break, but. As many of you guys already know, Brick Break is a very, very good move. Very helpful move if you need a fighting type Pokemon. And uh, look at that. I am a little beast. Thank you for calling me a little beast. Alrighty, so let's move on right here. We are at the home stretch of this whole thing. Home stretch, finally. Okay, alrighty, so let's go ahead and. Uh, alrighty. Let's go ahead. Uh, let's take on this person right here. Okay, so let's go right ahead and. Uh, Let's get this. Alrighty, so here we go. Picnicker Susie would like to battle it. She's got five Pokemon. Freaking annoying. So let's go Shockwave attacks. So how you doing, guys? Pretty good? Very awesome? Very, very good. Okay. And as you can see, Aaliyah destroys everybody. And uh, alrighty, Polyswag getting points. I'm gonna switch it out right here, and now I do have an option. Let's go with Polyswag. Let's go. Polyswag, you know what I want you to do? Destroy everybody. Polyswag, Brick Break. Alrighty, alrighty. So now many of you guys have been wondering, what was my initial idea with uh, picking out, uh, with picking out, what was it called, uh, Starmie? Well, like I said, I am really, really quick to the trigger. I really am. I, I've had a streak like that before, guys, and I'm and I do apologize for it. Uh, it's just that you know I thought that it would actually help me and help me instead of hurt me. But instead, yeah, like I said, it just it hurt me. It ended up hurting me a lot. And uh, yeah, look what happened in the last episode. Um, I don't know what what else I would uh, I would have done. I don't know. I think I would have uh, actually kept. I don't know if like if I would have continued on with Patrick, then I don't know what kind of Pokemon I would have been using after this. That's that's why I soft reset and I was doing my research before I do anything. I do right here, guys. I do a little bit of research. I do I do listen to your guys' comments when you guys say that hey, you know, uh, like in Pokemon Platinum, Gallade is more of a physical attacker. I listen and I switch the Psychic to Psycho uh, Cut right there. And I would like to thank the YouTuber who commented on that. Um, and everything else, guys, it, it's just research and just training right there, you know. It, it's just something that, you know, I, 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 I li like I like to do and I would like to, you know, uh, well, the game is something that I would like to make uh, done perfect because, remember, guys, my very first Leaf Green walkthrough, it wasn't that perfect. I, I kind of screwed that thing up, like, a lot. And uh, thankfully, thankfully, like, you know, I'm here to do to re redeem myself with all these kinds of stuff. If I'm making any sense right now, uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and uh, you know what? Let's continue on right here. Battle this person. My bird Pokemon wants to battle with you. Okay. All right. Let's do this. Whoo! All righty. Sebastian wants to battle, and he, he comes out with a Pidgey, and uh, I'm gonna go straight for Aaliyah, and uh, let's go with a Shockwave right here. I think this is the longest episode I have ever done. Oh my god. It is the longest episode I have ever done. And this is the reason why this freaking route here is just ridiculous. Oh my god. Nintendo, if this is if this is how it's going to be in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee, then you know what? I quit. <laughs> that, that right there is bad. Oh my god. Okay, and as you can see... Aaliyah and Polyswag getting experience points, just like that. Easy, easy stuff. Okay. Alrighty, so we got... Yeah, we got another trainer right here, upstairs. So, let's see, I found a Carbos in a cave once. 
once I, while I was spelunking. What the hell is spelunking? Is it like rock climbing? I think it is. I don't even know. Okay, so here we go. Picnicker Alma wants the battle, and she's coming with her Goldeen, and I am going straight to uh, Shockwave. No, I'm just playing Thunderbolt for Aaliyah right here. That's right. Now, the very first walkthrough that I've done, Pokemon Leaf Green, I actually finished it in 69 episodes. I don't know why, and I don't know how. There you go. 31. The reason I'm saying that is because, uh... Like, it's really hard for me to look back on it now, because, uh... Normally, in a walkthrough, I'll be finished in, like... I usually be finished in, like, 70 to 80 episodes if it's newer, uh... Newer, uh, walkthrough or newer, uh games like Pokemon Leaf Green all the way to like what we have right now in Generation 8. Uh, I think it might have been the whole transitions that I've made right there. I don't know. That could be it. I mean, shoot. I did do a lot of transitions on that. Oh, damn. And there you go. Holy swag and everybody gets experience points. And uh, from what I'm looking at right here, yes. Oh yes, we are at the tail end of this whole thing right here, because we already did the battling up top. Here we are in Route 12. Now, if you go right here, hold on just a sec, if you go in here, you, you will be able to find some pretty good Pokemon. Uh, let's see, some of the Pokemon you'll be able to find right here. If you're playing Leaf Green, Bellsprout, uh, Fire Red, Gloom, and then, uh, let's see, Oddish, Weeping Bell, of course, you got Venonats. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, Pidgeys, Pidgeotos, and then on the seas and the rivers right here, you'll be able to find some different types of Pokemon. Of course, you guys already know that I wanted to get, uh, I wanted to get Psyduck, but it doesn't say right here in the book that it was going to be in Fire Red, so I kind of got screwed right there a little. I really did. Alrighty, so here we go. Fisherman Andrew wants the battle, and he's coming out with the, oh, really? A weak Magikarp. Holy bejeebus. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. Look at that. Oh, yes. Magikarp, you have been defeated. Okay. And, uh, wow. He only has Magikarps. This, this is very disappointing. Okay. Alrighty. I think we have, like, two more trainers and an item right here. And that's it. Yeah. That is pretty much it right there. Look at that. Magikarp, you have been defeated too. This is very disappointing, guys. It really is. So there you go. Defeated you. And uh, let's go right ahead and go onto this area right here where you need cut. And uh, you will be able to find an extra item. I believe this is iron. So before we battle this guy, let's go ahead and... Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and switch out my Pokemon. Let's go back to Execumon for a little bit. Bring it! I'm searching for a Moonstone. Have you found one? No, I haven't. I haven't found a Moonstone. Oh, actually, wait, I found three. <laughs> I lied. Yeah, I found three Moonstones, guy. And I evolved two Pokemon with it. I can evolve another one if I wanted to. So here we go. Confusion for the win. Oh, yes. Look at that. Oh, my God. Executmon, you have been a godset. You really have been because, man... This is a complete 180 from what happened in the last episode. It really pissed me off. So here we go. Confusion again for the win. Alrighty. Okay. Alrighty. And uh, let's see. Polyswag. There you go. And he's like, ow. That's right. You've been defeated. And what do you have to say? I could make have made my Pokemon evolve with the Moonstone. I would have won then. I bet. No, you wouldn't. I have Executmon. And here we have an Iron raises the defense and uh, we got one more trainer right here before we finish off this whole excavation of uh, <laughs> Pokemon trainers holy Jesus man it has been a long episode and I hope all you guys have has stayed here holy crud you guys can tell like I'm a little tired of just talking but trust me guys it will it's all worth it in the long run so here we go one more trainer electricity is my specialty I don't know a thing about Pokemon of the sea though I mean you can make them faint I mean electricity so here we go rocker Luca wants the battle and he's coming with Voltorb okay all right Voltorb you pokeball looking mother lover you so there we go we're digging we dug a hole what do you got? And wow, self-destruct right there. You missed. 
Okay! <laughs> Look at that. Okay. And uh, he's going to come out with an electrode. This, this is the first time we're seeing an electrode right here. And uh, here we go. Sonic Boom. But There we go. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh my god, this worked out perfectly for us. There we go. So, Rocker Luca has been unplugged. Oh my god. Okay, so, that is pretty much it, guys. We have defeated everybody, and uh, now it is finally time to go back to uh, Celadon City and to take care of business. So, oh my god, it's been a huge, huge uh, episode right here. Like, an hour, close to an hour and 30 minutes. I could be wrong. Holy crap. Oh, damn. So, the next episode, we will be going up against gym leaders battling everybody and then hopefully getting us to uh, Saffron City because there is an issue going on right there too. Uh, in the meantime, guys, I hope you enjoyed all these episodes that have come up so far. Uh, Pokemon Leaf Green, I'm again, I'm trying to make it as successful as uh, as I can, as better than the last time if you guys if you guys are still there from the very first one. And then uh, yeah. You know, this is also this is also giving me the idea that, you know what, maybe I should come out with another one of the remakes. Uh, one of the remakes that comes to mind is Pokemon, what was it, Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Uh, reason I'm saying that is because if I, if I do Pokemon Soul Silver or Heart Gold, it's going to take me as long as it did with Platinum because I still need to do like, uh, it's not a live com. Live com, I usually do the narrating while I'm doing the, the recording right here. So. You know, that's my thought right there, and uh, hopefully we can reach that uh, re reach that point at some point here soon, if that made any sense. I'm a little tired, guys. I'm sorry. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode for a bunch of gym battles right here. And, uh, yeah, hopefully it all goes well. Alright, see you guys. Mm -hmm.